just let, the other day. Uh, the law enforcement is in the area. They are looking for it right now, though. You can see the driving style really has changed. He's kind of blending in with traffic, driving more with like the other cars on the roadway. Uh, Pat, the answer to your question, he passed the vehicle on the 5 freeway so fast, kind of sideswiping it. Sparks came flying off that vehicle. Getting back off the 5 freeway right here, and I would guess we're going to give you an answer here in just a second. I think we're at Rye Canyon. But you can see that car basically by itself right now. Also, if you know this area, there's a California Highway Patrol uh, actually station nearby. I don't think he's going to be going there to report an accident. That's what he should be doing right now, trying to blend in. But many eyes on this vehicle this afternoon. A pursuit that brought us down from the Bakersfield area. Cannot stress that enough. And at sometimes speeds of up to 150 miles an hour on the 5 freeway. Not far from Magic Mountain. Yeah, he, right now, he, he, no, no, he's he is he's he's just sitting there right now, basically trying to blend in. Uh, we know that the I just heard the California Highway Patrol talking about Rye Canyon and the old road. They were just talking about it, so I'm going to kind of keep that shot a little bit wider, just in case we see one of those black and whites make their way over to this area. Uh, but California Highway Patrol interested. It's still trying to catch up and find this vehicle wanted for crimes in the Bakersfield area. They were in pursuit for some time. Bad weather. They were actually talking about rain up by uh, Pyramid Lake. That's the reason why they slowed down. There's one of those highway patrol vehicles. There's a couple of them. Uh, I just wish we could say, hey, you just drove right by that guy. Uh, right now, though, the, this guy's still waiting for that light, green light right now. Kind of curious what he's going to do. Maybe he's going to fall in behind those cars. But uh, this started up in the Bakersfield area. Extremely high speeds, extremely dangerous, and at least one collision we saw on the 5 freeway. Uh, looks like he's... Uh, yeah, it looks like he's trying to blend in. Perhaps maybe this is going to be the point where he's going to get out and run. But uh, maybe he doesn't. Maybe he's not too familiar with uh, how things work down here in Los Angeles. Not trying to poke any fun at this guy. Uh, but he's got to know that there's several people, <laughs> several eyes watching him right now. And uh, I can tell you some communications being made. We're going to keep an eye on him, make sure he doesn't jump out and try to run. But uh, definitely playing some possum right now. Yep, that's it. One of the California Highway Patrols making his way over here right now. You can see that officer. He's not playing. He's still out here by himself right now. Definitely called for backup right before he got out of that vehicle. So we'll probably see some other California Highway Patrol joining him in a minute. There they are. Uh, you can see that officer, though, gun out. And it actually even looks like he might have been some sort of reserve. Uh, just he, he's not in uniform, so perhaps... They were, they were calling everybody on deck when this guy was el eluding him. Right now, though, definitely one suspect in, c in custody. This thing coming to an end. Started in Bakersfield. Right now, coming to an end out here in the uh, Santa Clarita area. Very close. Uh, Valencia. Very, very close to Magic Mountain. definitely well they're making they're just making sure that there's nobody else in that vehicle we've seen this so many times before they're going to pop that trunk take a look at that person's dirty laundry yeah they just want to make sure that it, there is nobody in there maybe against their will they always have to make sure right now though that uh, suspect in custody that vehicle he tried to hide but it just didn't work and now in custody the, the pursuit started in bakersfield got down here 
lickety split, 150 miles an hour at some point. It was just uh, crazy. Thank goodness nobody was hurt. But uh, also, we know that he did make he did collide with at least one other vehicle. So hopefully, those people are okay as well. Uh, we'll find out. Just stay here for a minute or two. Fox is probably on, still on his. Hey. Uh, I was working on that. 